Iran has achieved a groundbreaking milestone by successfully launching the Chamran-1 research satellite into orbit with the Qiyam-100 rocket, marking a significant leap in its space capabilities and ambitions. Hello everyone, welcome back to Meshkat. Today, we're diving into a significant milestone in Iran's space program, the successful launch of the Chamran-1 research satellite. On September 14, 2024, Iran used its domestically developed QRM-100 satellite carrier to place Chamran-1 into orbit. This achievement marks another step forward in Iran's growing space capabilities. Let's explore the details of this launch and its implications. The Chamran-1 satellite, weighing approximately 60 kilograms, 132 pounds, is a research satellite developed by the Space Group of Iran Electronics Industries, say Iran, in collaboration with the Aerospace Research Institute and private tech companies. Its primary mission is to test hardware and software systems for orbital maneuver technology validation, a critical capability for future space missions. Secondary tasks. Assess the performance of cold gas propulsion subsystems and evaluate navigation and attitude control subsystems. The satellite successfully reached an orbit of 550 kilometers, 340 mile, and ground stations were able to receive its first signals shortly after launch, marking a significant achievement in Iran's space capabilities. This satellite plays a key role in validating new space technologies that will pave the way for more advanced future satellites. Powering this launch was the KM-100 satellite carrier, a three-stage solid-fuel rocket developed by the Aerospace Force of Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps (IRGC). The KM-100 represents a significant leap in Iran's space launch capabilities as it is the first solid-fuel rocket capable of placing satellites into orbit. Here are some key features. Type: three-stage solid-fuel satellite launch vehicle. Thrust. The first stage is powered by the Rafay motor, capable of producing 68 tons force of thrust. Payload capacity. It can carry satellites weighing up to 80 kilograms into low Earth orbit, LEO, at altitudes of around 750 kilometers. The QIM-100 is designed for reliability, efficiency, and performance, allowing for quicker launch preparations compared to its predecessor, the Kased rocket, which used liquid fuel. This advancement is crucial for increasing the frequency of satellite launches, which Iran aims to enhance significantly. This launch represents the second successful orbital mission for the Qaim-100, following its previous attempts, including a failed launch in March 2023. The Qaim-100 is expected to be the cornerstone of Iran's future satellite launch operations. The successful launch of the Chamran-1 aboard the Qiyam-100 carrier is not just a technological achievement, it has significant scientific, space, technical, and military implications for Iran. Scientific Advancements The Chamran-1 satellite is key for future missions, providing vital data on orbital maneuvering, crucial for the development of more sophisticated satellites. Space Achievements Iran solidifies its standing among the top 10 countries capable of independently launching satellites. Iran's ability to validate and test propulsion and control systems ensures that its next generation of satellites will be more advanced. Technical Achievements The success of the KM-100 underscores Iran's growing expertise in solid-fuel rocket technology, paving the way for more frequent satellite deployments. Military Implications Solid fuel technology like that used in QIM-100 can also have military applications, particularly in ballistic missile development. Iran has consistently maintained that its space program is for civilian purposes. However, the dual-use nature of the technology, especially solid fuel systems, means that this launch has both civilian and military applications, making it a strategic asset for the country. Iran's space program has evolved significantly since the country launched its first satellite, Omid, in 2009. Today, Iran ranks first among Islamic countries and 13th globally in aerospace achievements. Regionally, it leads the space race in the Middle East and is determined to continue expanding its influence in the global space arena. Despite the economic sanctions imposed on the country, 
Iran has continued to make advances in both its space and military capabilities. Looking ahead, Iran has ambitious plans for its space program. The country aims to launch at least 13 more satellites in the near future, with even more advanced capabilities for communications, weather monitoring, and Earth observation. While Iran faces opposition from Western nations, it continues to strengthen its space partnerships with other global powers, aiming to strengthen its position in the global space community. The successful launch of Chamran-1 using the Kwa M100 carrier represents a major milestone for Iran's space program. It demonstrates the country's growing technological capabilities in satellite technology, launch systems, and space operations, and its determination to become a major player in the space sector. As Iran continues to develop its space program, it will be interesting to see how these advancements impact scientific research, technological innovation, and regional dynamics in the years to come. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts on this development in the comments below.